it in 2008. I don't know when they really had online play. I think this was 2008. Oh, this is a different intro. On the first day. Oh, my God. Ba -ba -ba. Man was granted a soul and with it clarity. We have like Arya in the background. <laughs> On the second day, upon earth was planted an irrevocable poison, a soul devouring demon. Yes. Get them demons. Oh, someone. Some dead guy. Oh, no, <laughs> yeah. it's really not. Having a bad day. <laughs> oh. It's just a hollow. Uh, Fiona, can, can you give me your best Gregorian chant? Uh, I can't summon the memory of a Gregorian chant right now. <laughs> uh, that's... Oh, uh, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Oh, look, oh. we have our knight doing cool shit. Sword play. Very Draken guard. Hmm, wonder why. What? I mean... <laughs> yes. I mean, because there's a dude yes. and then there's going to be a dragon and they're fighting a nonsense fight in a castle court anyways. Yeah. It's all very it's, it's good. awesome. You have your dragon crest shield. That's a dragon crest shield, isn't it? Oh, shit! <laughs> That's really got to fuck up your day when you're fighting dudes and then you just get attacked by a bone golem. That's a bone golem, right? Yeah, it's not a skeleton. It's got way too much other parts and stuff grafted on. You know, we don't use the word skeleton around here. We use skellington. Oh, the, sorry. The proper name. So is that just like a magic shade over there? It's probably like a blue spirit, like someone helping, right? Oh, you're right. Yeah, it's some co-op. God, these games are so cool. Yeah, they're going to totally do a pose or something. Oh, it's going to be sick. And the old armor was like very oh. JRPG. Ooh. Oh, watch the little mouth vibrate. Yes. See the little mouth it vibrates. <laughs> <laughs> That's a serious dragon. It is a serious dragon. And this is press A to gate. Hey, I'm uh, Tony. My pronouns are they, them. I'm Fiona. My pronouns are they, them. Wow. And so we're, we're, we're excited to bring this to you. We, we almost played Sekiro. I apologize, oh. but they, they tied the Patreon vote tied between Demon Souls and Sekiro. And, and we've been talking Demon Souls for a while. We've, I basically was like, hey, Fiona, do you want to play Demon Souls? And you're like, yeah, that could be fun. And then like you texted me later like, yeah, I played some Demon Souls just to get ready. And I was like, oh, <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa. We actually we have a name. We have several names to choose from. Oh, cool. Um, because these are the ones that we haven't used recently. Would you like to use Turt Reynolds? <laughs> Bartholomew or Jean-Luc de Floof? Uh, we should try to do as much of the Jean-Luc as we can get. Yeah, see, the problem with Jean-Luc de Floof is that historically we only get a little bit of Jean-Luc de Floof. It's, it's like Jean-Luc or Jean-Luc de. And it's, it's like, cool. I mean, we can try doing like capitalizing, um, or not. We can try doing no spaces, but with capital letters that could work out, but we'll see. These are Patreon names. Yeah, let's see. Uh, let's see. How that's, much it'll fit. That's right. You could be immortalized on a shitty YouTube video. That's right. <laughs> you. Th I'm talking to you. Uh, I believe duh is uh, lowercase, Fiona. Oh, well, excuse my non-French. How embarrassing. Uh, there. Oh, I'm excited. What What are we doing? Was it floof? Uh, yes, that's a capital F floof. As, as in like the royal floof. I'm only, I can only assume this is like, I, I forget, um, I forget this person I think said this is like a cat. There. Maybe it's their cat. Jean-Luc de Floof. We actually got the whole name in. It fits. Yeah. The Adventures of Jean-Luc oh. de Floof. Jean-Luc de Floof. Oof. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, it does it not fit. <laughs> this, we have Jean-Luc de Floof. Oh, should we? Maybe. Wait, 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 wait. We can go back here and do. Get rid of a space. We're going to get rid of Hold on, we're gonna do some fancy uh, stuff here. Oh, apostroph! Oh wait, is it? Oh no, we have a tick. A t is we have wait. a back tick. Oh Duh. boy, that Oof. was a that was a good maneuver, Fiona. You saved yes. the day. There we oh. go. Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah. So, what kind of character are we going with? <clears throat> um, oh. I usually go with the. Female soldier? Look or at not that soldier, but <laughs> and she looks ready. Look at her. <laughs> oh. Um. So I think I asked in our Discord, and people didn't necessarily want to see a magic build, and I understand. Like most play, like 
magic is going to be the easiest way to play it, but it's also maybe not as exciting. Uh, uh, kind of unlike Dark... In fact, I'd say unlike Dark Souls and 2, mm-hmm. kind of 3, magic is so strong in Demon's <laughs> it's Souls. It's very strong. And by the way, we're saying Demon's Souls. Demon's it's, Soul? Isn't it Demon's Soul? And Oh, oh shit, is it? <laughs> Fuck, no. it, gets, it gets more and more complex every time. Uh... I know we're literally playing the game, but I'm going to Google it. Demons. Soul. Soul. I think it's souls. It's yeah. demon souls, right? Yeah. De- well, t- sorry. We really got to make sure we emphasize demons souls. Oh. I mean, you're never going to see the head of the character. Right? Oh, but Fiona, we're a, we're a video game YouTube channel. We got to have a good time. <laughs> there are all many, only so many times. Like, wait, wait, sorry. Go back to black or dark brown or, or any of those. Like it's it's like it's like there's an alpha layer. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but yeah, there are only so many times that you play these games. It's true. Unless you're a channel that exclusively plays uh, these games. I mean, we could go total like Ripley here. Oh, that'd be sick. But also, we could just kind of hit random for a while. Yeah. Just kind of see what happens. And you have to change where you're from, and then that gives you like. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, all right. All right. I feel like I've seen this person, right? you know? Yeah. Like I I, I know this that person. person. I know this person. All right. Is that good? Yeah, sure. You can go uh, just to show some people like you can go deep into this. Like you can get right. you can get into some stuff with this. Because I I missed this game and and went right into Dark Souls with the mm. character creator, but I hadn't realized that like here in 2008, you had some re- ridiculous character like creators jawline, going on. like right. distance of nose all these things um i was playing with the classes and because of a quality build we talked about yes um it's either temple knight or knight and i think temple knight is technically better but i hate the starting weapon <laughs> it's it's a halberd and it's, it's like a halberd yeah and it's kind of cool in that the, the moveset seems realistic but the moveset feels bad <laughs> it's very difficult i played through the first level as a temple knight and it was very difficult and then i tried it as a knight and it's a lot easier because you just start with a long sword so i'm gonna do that for my own sanity because as soon as you get through like the first initial level like the world is our oyster we can totally pick different weapons and yeah because we can go into the world in any order we want yep. correct you can play the game com- pretty close to completely out of order in fact this the the speed run of this is very, very fun. Uh, oh, I've never King seen a speed, speed run. run. By oh, King Alant. How he did that, no one knows. Hmm, he's just badass. He's the king. Kind yeah, I guess so. Is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. I don't understand how something doesn't have a color. Well, I think that's part of the appeal. Mm. And those who oh, oh, here's where we start to get that never returned mm. that so it's like raven music <laughs> <laughs> yeah kind of fangs broke free from the fog and told the world of boletaria's plight actually it's a lot like um the raven loft setting i forget the name of the land i also forget the name of the land from its bavaria bavaria and that a colorless really isn't it in. I, mean, I don't know. I, I I forget. The demons the colorless so fog. The giant demons. Look how big they are. That's such a badass map painting. That is a badass map painting. Look at that one on the right that's just sucking up the souls of hundreds of dudes. Valorfax spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. That's the demon's soul. <laughs> The demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force. The Same. <laughs> soul is beyond human imagination. Mm. You you only fight one enemy that's of this scale, don't you? That's just the huge. And that, yeah, that's it, really. Mm. Yeah, there, there are many who are very large, but yeah, maybe not many, but a few. Well, the true demons are too big and powerful for any one person. Which is odd, because that almost... Well, well. <laughs> by the way, these are characters. They are. We will see them around. All of them, yeah. Or summons or something. Wow, these are all great paintings, aren't they? Yeah. Ah, uh, Sage Freak. The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. 
it sucks. That's a huge city too. Yeah, that's like um. That big. Yeah. And uh, that's our. Oh, I fucking forgot. Okay, a right. lone warrior. And is way cooler than everyone else. <laughs> Or have the demons found a new slave? Her, dun, dun, dun. her name is super ridiculous. <laughs> oh. I think these are all NPCs as well. They are NPCs. I used one of these to make the title card. Mm. And it looks really cool. Awesome. Or at least I, I think haven't it seen looks it really yet. Cool. So. I'll show you a picture. And there's us in the fog. Yeah, I feel like that's not as colorless as claimed, but whatever. We're really just some asshole. Yeah, kind of. It's the great promise of demons, souls. You're just some <laughs> asshole. Yeah, I mean, in Dark Souls, you're just some hollow, right? Yeah, yeah. In, in Dark Souls 3, it's like, okay, you're an important hollow. <laughs> kind of. Ashen Blow one. the old one back to slumber. Is the old one the dragon? No. Or is that the king? Nope. I forget. Yep. I I almost beat this game, but I could nope. not beat the second to last boss for the life of me. We have to fix the things. <laughs> also, turn the brightness up, please. Will do. Uh, eight's fine. Eight. Yeah. Okay. Subtitles. Yes. Yes. Uh, everything. Music yes. is good. All right. Well, I mean, we'll see. <laughs> I don't uh, I'm gonna turn down the vibration. That's good. Sometimes vibration's too much. It's good when there's the option to like change the level of vibration. I feel like that is nice. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. There. You you seem like <laughs> that that this is possibly the most trans person Luke I've seen in a while. You just I mean it, this, it it's me. Like <laughs> Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I have more hair, but ultimately, like, it's pretty. Like, you have the, the top that, that, you know, instead of just being like a sort of crop top slash bra, it could, it, it could also be a binder. And it's yeah. like, uh -huh. We have like a really neutral haircut because we're a knight. We don't have time to like have fancy hair. Right. That shit gets in the way. It pinches. It like when you put on your helmet. Oh, and stuff. right. Like, I have a motorcycle helmet, and yeah, you can't be like, it's, it's really dark in this hallway, isn't it? It's super dark. This is why I asked that we turn the brightness up. This game is much darker I than usually turn up the, the brightness pretty far, just because the game is very dark. Yeah, souls. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, so, other things. Oh, you have another sword with you? Uh, yeah, you start with a mail breaker, too. That's cool. It's got a parry. Or no, how do I? Uh, your other, other sword. Other hand. Oh, that's right. Yeah. It's, it's like a small thrusting weapon, right? Uh, yes. Okay. Yeah, that's right. So we do that. There we go. Yeah, it's got the. <laughs> it's got the buckler parry. It's almost like a sweet salute. Uh, so I have I have a little story to tell. Do it. We, uh, well, I had a lot of trouble getting this game so that we could record it. I don't know if you know this, folks, but the PS3 is a little bit difficult to get video output from when you're doing stuff and so i was panicking last night thinking oh shit for some reason i thought i had the right cable i don't think i have the right cable <laughs> with our old elgato because we're using our old elgato so i was like fuck well maybe i should emulate it because apparently oh. this game emulates super well oh that's good right and i was like great i guess i'll just emulate it and so i went to emulate it i downloaded the thing mm -hmm. i got like a R, it's like called RPCS3 hmm. emulator. I got the game by ripping my own legally owned copy, and it, everything yeah. was going great. But then it wasn't launching. I was like, "Oh fuck!" And for what I, I had to like go into my reg edit to delete old AMD drivers. Oh and, wow! And that actually worked kind of to make it start doing stuff. And I was like, "What's going on?" And then I had to reinstall my video drivers, and then that did other stuff, and it kind of made it work. But ultimately, it was a shit show. <laughs> And there are so many videos of like, look at me running Demon Souls, kind of at, oh nice, <laughs> kind of at uh, that 720p, but it's like kind of 4K, 
even though it's not really, and it's like, what's going on? A partial parry, you can get those. So you, I got tagged a little bit, but I still got the parry. That is an interesting difference. Mm -hmm. It was a little more... Parrying in this is quite easy in comparison, I think. Mm -hmm. So this is your typical Dark Souls you tutorial, or fr I guess I should say FromSoft you tutorial, right? Fr well, from software. <laughs> Because if it was a typical FromSoft tutorial, we'd be collecting skate tapes right now. <laughs> Which would be sick if we, if that was, I don't know, that yeah. sounds awesome. I would love that. Oh, and by the way, the end to my story is emulating is always way harder than you think it's going to be. Mm. It's never a nice like, oh, I'll just like take 30 minutes and get this up and running. No, no. So you have like a little jump when you do your stab. Like, which is kind of funny. Can you do it? Oh, whoops. Do a little. <laughs> I had, uh, yeah, let me make him shoot at me again. <laughs> or not, I guess. Okay, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, you have a, like little, a little skip, yeah. Does, does your R2 have a follow up attack in this? Um. Yeah. Huh. So, by the way, the reason for having fog gates like that where it's not a boss, correct me if I'm wrong, um, would be. Oh, what? I didn't. Uh oh, mm. may have to tinker with the controls. But the reason is, I think, so that you can't just run straight through and mm, like there'll be enemies like chasing you. I'm pretty sure that's the reason why you have fog gates like I that. I can't under, why am I? You hit, I assume square on accident, but it didn't hmm. seem like you hit square on yeah. accident. Yeah, okay. I don't know. Mm. All right. This oh, is... so in typical tutorial fashion, right? So I get one shot at this boss. <laughs> <laughs> Which is great. Also, if you die, then you don't get the bonus. Yes. Also, another from soft thing uh, where Fiona's about to do a manual uh, into a quarter pipe, hard flip onto a rail. It's going to be rad. All right, you can do a lot of damage to this thing, actually. Oops. Oh. Not if I do that. Well, you know, life happens. Oh, shit. So I heard, um, I heard tale that there was a speed, not a speed runner, but like a, like someone who plays all these Souls games, who was going for like what he called the God Run, which is you play this, Dark Souls 1 through 3, and Bloodborne all in a row without taking a single hit. What? A single hit? Without taking a single hit. No, no hits. Now, but his, his rule was that he was allowed to do self-inflicted damage for, like, red tear stone rings and, um, like, for fall damage and stuff like that. But other than that, zero hits. And so he got to Demon Souls, which was the last game he was doing. Mm. Like, he did Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3, and Bloodborne without taking a single ass hit. Yeah. But then this opening boss somehow nicked him. And it, it was so sad because it, it, it was like caught on video. And it was like, oh, you poor buddy. Hey, you're getting a, getting a pretty all right pattern here. Yeah. Just kind of sh shambling about. I mean, it, take, it takes a little bit of time to kill this boss because you have to be patient, but. Right. Um, and by the way, we are, uh, we are doing a speed run of this. We're going for the <laughs> world record. Oh, I'm so not that good at this game. I mean, I'm okay at it, but... Well, I mean, that's why that's why you practiced for um, a couple years. The hour. <laughs> the, the hour. <laughs> yeah, because I don't know if y'all know this, but every single LP we do on the channel is a speedrun. Mm. It's just a really shitty speedrun. <laughs> mm, getting greedy. I think the only... Not speedrun, but the only, like, fast playthrough of a game that we've done on the channel nice mm. was maybe dandara which you and i played yeah together. you blew through that pretty fast i think you had just played it so it was yes. really fresh right like like that level of mastery that you get when it's not necessarily like this game where there there is a high level of mastery that mm. like a very high level of mastery that you can get in demon souls but like the level of difference between someone who is just starting dandara versus someone who's like got to the end of the game is like you're just zipping around like super quick there's our giant dragon friend from the from the intro yeah so you can actually do a, upset. um 
an exploit here where you make friends with the dragon and it calms down and you know you it's just like a frame perfect button press though yeah it's, it's difficult. <laughs> super difficult it's actually sub frame perfect it's mm. uh you have to hit it on the 1 20th of the third <laughs> frame super tough so because we killed that last like boss we got 500 souls or something from him and then all this loot here which is great some hard stone that is good some sharp stone some souls some souls this is like a nice bonus yeah it's it, it's quite a bit because i'm like so there's dark... our big ass dragon friend so buff oh he's so big there he is just look how ripped it is right like just like that's some like that's some evangelion level like it muscle is. definition <laughs> or right like, let's or do like it Mr. let's talk X. to him all right so excuse fiona's me, gonna sir. go for it excuse me sir all right here's here's cut oh how oh, they missed uh. it that's it's all like right. playing Dragon's Lair. <laughs> yeah, it's a, yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> you died. However, the Nexus traps you. You shall remain in this world as a soul forever. It's so funny because that text is so fast, but it's just like, what? <laughs> wait, what do you, what wait, do you what? mean? <laughs> like, I died. <laughs> like, shit. Like, like my, wait, trap for, oh, wait, wait, no, no, hold, wait, come back. <laughs> like, what? Because <laughs> that's the only time I think you see it. Right, like yeah. uh, you, I think we get like a little bit of exposition from um, I, I forget her name, the, the black, black lady or the lady in black. Lady in black, I, I think that's it, right? Yeah, yeah. I guess it's not the black lady. Right, I think she's a white lady. Uh, she's praying without subtitles. The subtitles are on. I checked. I know. This is an older game. A friend of mine does accessibility reviews. That's really cool. Yeah, I, like I want to post about it. So remind me and I will give you a link because it's really important work. If you're not, I would love to retweet that shit. Yep. With with our loyal following of Twitter. Twitter well, I mean, I'll, we'll post it on YouTube so at least they can go check it out. It's really cool. Oh, You're yeah. doing great work. Yeah, look in the link uh, below this and yes. you will find a link to that. This it's pretty cool. Well, I don't know if it's pretty cool. I assume it's pretty cool. We'll see. I, I trust you. What's going on? Oh god, I, I just died. Like, oh, holy fuck. Like, wait, we're, <laughs> we're just like, holy shit. <laughs> like, I, oh my god. <laughs> Why are you talking about a nexus? A like, nexus? I, I just got punched by a dragon god? You cannot escape the nexus. All right. Okay, so we do see the text again. All right. Remember, by capturing demons' souls, you can reclaim your physical body. Nexial binding. That's your uh, thing that warps you back, right? Yeah, dark sign or whatever. It it eats all your souls, though. Arr. This is like developer messages down here and some tutorial stuff that we never looked at. Uh, the online, the official online servers for this game have long since closed. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and but there is a fan one that has come up come about, so you can play online. And we're, but we're not doing that because no, not I think we play. We'd probably be invaded every 20 seconds <laughs> by the 20 people who are constantly on it. Mm. I would that's how I assume it would go. There's no limit, <laughs> it's a problem. <laughs> yeah, I didn't know what hit me when I came to. I found myself here in the Nexus. I mean, he's just got bags of shit. The last thing I saw was a super buff dragon, <laughs> but I would be worth it. Sucked at the very least. I hope to lend my hope assistance to, lend to assistance. Grave slayers of demons. I would be happy to lighten your load and look after <laughs> the excess. Yeah, damage. give me your loot so when you go out to get killed, uh, just like keep your loot. Yeah, because this uh, this game has a. Uh, so they have like, a very aggressive here. I'll just go ahead and pull it up, so but, we can we can show it a little bit. Yeah. So on the right hand side, we have equipment burden, which is the items I have equipped, and then we have item burden, which is the amount of crap we're packing around. Yes. So the armor I took off so I could fast roll is we still weighing me down. Yes. So I have to deposit these heavy upgrade rocks. <laughs> just just carrying around like some big rocks. Yeah. Let's get rid of them. Uh, we'll get rid of the help the mail breaker. I don't need it. Uh, also, Fiona, can uh, can we start referring to each other um, as uh, I'll refer to you as Let's Play Fiona, and you refer to me <laughs> as Let's Play Tony. Let's Play Tony. Oh, actually, that sounds cursed. <laughs> God damn it. I, that. Mm. Mm. Why do uh, I, I have to do this to myself? Okay, let's just ditch this stuff for now. 
save my full moon grass, save my half moon grass. Like save it in the sense that you'll never let yourself use it? Well, I won't use it now. Um, I They're good enough that I want to hold on to them. Right. Um, because this is the, there's no, uh, what do you call it? Sunny D. There's no Estus flask. Are, are, aren't we going to, we're gonna, we're gonna, you said something about an exploit. Oh, there is an item exploit. Uh, the they never fixed it, so I can duplicate any item I can stow. Duplicate any item. Wow, that seems Watch. strong. So it's it's a little weird, and it's I'll lose my souls. So I'll lose the six hundred souls. So maybe we should level up first. Uh, you can't level up until you beat the first area. So my souls oh, are well, garbage, but I can buy stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, whoops! I should have paid attention. To the- <laughs> <laughs> well, wow, they, I've done this a few times. Sorry. So this this uh, uh, Ar- armor Smith Lloyd or whatever his name is. Yep. Uh, he's a combination merchant and upgrade upgrade person. And he's an asshole. That's one yeah, of his personality I'm gonna buy, traits. I will buy uh, one of those. Oh, really? A fresh spice, so we have some. Oh, because I guess we only need to get one. <laughs> Technically, yeah. Oh, I see what's going on here. <laughs> Well, I need. I might as well spend some of the uh, souls I have, and then you have to repair your stuff a lot too. Okay. Is there anything else we can get no, right now? Not right now. Okay. So the X. Ex- I'm. I'm gonna have to try to do this from memory. It's simple. Do, do you want me to look it up? No. We can also do it off camera later. No, no, no. Let's see if I can remember. That's a hurry. Oh, it involves. Are you off to? Have you any manners? Oh, I should have. Um... Oh, wow, that is clipping in our headphones. <laughs> you better bet your bell bottoms. I'm going to turn that down and then turn this other this dial up. I feel like my life a lot of times is turning various volume sliders down and turning other volume sliders mm. up. But like for the same audio source. Oh, my, this is riveting. I don't remember. <laughs> Here, we'll, 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 we'll do it off camera. All right. No worries. Should we... I guess I have enough grass. Oh, yeah. It's probably plenty to chew on. Okay. Okay. So which which world are we doing first? Oh, we don't have a choice right now. Oh. He oh, is, yeah. Let's this talk is to this our, guy. This is our crestfallen dude. Let's talk to him. Well, you slipped through the fissure too, did you? You came for demon souls? Or to save this land and be remembered as a hero? <laughs> cool. That's a weird laugh. Try one of the arch stones. Do you remember if in like Kingsfield or any previous from software games, if they had characters with weird, kind of creepy laughs? Uh, I never ended up playing Kingsfield. Uh, me neither. Hey, if you're if you're watching this and you know, please tell us. Like in Kingsfield <laughs> or other previous from software games, did they have the weird laughs where it's like, uh, it's like, hey, if you go around this corner. You'll find something very useful to you. <laughs> I'm just checking for the other merchants. Um, oh, yeah. Oh, who's well, she's not a she's not a merchant, oh but she's a friend. How has this happened? Has God abandoned us for failing to show proper respect to King Alant? Oh, that's highly Mbasa. specific. Who's she, Mbasa? Mbasa is a prayer. Oh, right. So she's religious. She has like a little religious y stuff. Um, there's no other. This The Nexus is very empty right now. It will. It eventually fills out as we rescue people and meet people in the game. So these archstones represent the worlds. I, I imagine we have to go to the first world. Uh, now that I'm thinking about it, I don't know if we have to do the. F- well, first. which world do you want to uh, go let's, to? Fiona? We should go to Bulletarian Palace because once we go through here, it unlocks us leveling up, say. Oh, like, do you not get that by going to the other ones? Uh, I don't know. Everyone always does <laughs> Bohotarian Palace. Oh, first. I see. Even I see. in speed runs. Like, okay. I think you have to get through this one no matter what. So it might be that I can't warp anywhere else, too. Uh, yeah, who knows? That's a mystery. We'll never we'll never find we'll, out. We'll never, ever know. God, St. Urbane looks like such a <laughs> hard ass, like metal snake kind of dude. Yeah, like a <laughs> like a Chad. <laughs> oh, jeez. I don't Are you e- saying Metal Snake is a Chad? I don't. I don't even know what Metal <laughs> Snake is. I assume it's a band. Isn't it Solid Snake stuff? Metal Gear Solid. Oh, oh! But you said Metal Snake. 
Oh, I see. I don't know what I'm talking <laughs> about. <laughs> I don't play this. I don't play video games. Uh, check this out. Yeah, name one time you've played a video this game. homie is just like, do, 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 do. I'm a big dragon. Oh. It's just wreck stuff. God. Eat a couple dudes. Wow. I, that sound bite just <laughs> brought back so many vivid memories of trying to run past these things. Also, that's the sound that the the wyvern drakes, um, mm. the, the thunder drakes, or thunder wives, I don't, I don't know, yeah. in Dark Souls 1 make. Yeah. And so we're going to be trying to do some uh, pretty intense uh, phase manipulation. Phase world world state man manipulation. Oh, are we gonna do world state? Oh, yeah, we haven't even talked about things like state yet. Should we talk about the? Yeah, you know, let's leave that for after the first boss, I guess. Let's let's not worry about it. Yeah, we should have checked the. Um, can we look at it here? Uh, yeah, I it's think... on this one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So world tendency and player's soul tendency. They had a really interesting like. I don't want to call it a karmic system, but it was kind of. Well, so like that door, for instance, that, that you just saw down that alleyway, isn't that only open in, in a certain world tendency? Oh, it's back. Yeah, this gate right there is only open in pure dark or pure white soul tendency. So and you have to manipulate the world state to like make change the area you're in. Yes, and it's pretty hard to say exactly what any of that actually means lore wise, but it probably means stuff so like like why is it that that where the world tends to darkness i don't know if that's well, actually how it works but because it's a problem right like, but but why is the gate open does does that mean like the dark jester opened the door and snake oh well there's different there. there will be different monsters over there so there will actually be npcs like named people in different world tendencies so maybe they oh i didn't it. know that yeah Oh. That's how you get, that's how you, like, fight specific NPCs for specific weapons and stuff like that. Yeah, so, uh, I don't know if y'all can tell, but, um, I've played this game many times. Fiona has only played it <laughs> once, except the opposite of what I just said. Mm. Yeah. Oh, I should note that our health bar is terrible because we are hollowed, uh, or the equivalent of hollowed. And we Dead? Not be soul form, that's right, it's soul form. Soul form, you're right. We're just like a soul made a corporal. Yep, Corporeal. so we're in soul form, which means that uh, we are not to our fullest life extent. That that was, Fiona, that was a wonderful way of saying <laughs> that. You are, you are a world tendency treasure. Oh, come on, shoot at me. Okay, fine. You do a sweet... <laughs> <laughs> I just stepped on him. Like, oh, hey. It was almost like you, you fell down and gave, and gave his back like a little smooch, like... <laughs> that looks fun. Just check this out. There's like little sparkles and like some rafters and stuff to jump on. Is that like instant death? Uh, it is. Oh. <laughs> I hate uh, that. There is some world tendency stuff that goes along with that. Oh, really? Yep. Oh. Hmm. Yeah. There's a lot of really fun world tendency things, ah. even though manipulating world tendency is like you get one shot and if you mess it up. Uh, well, you have to like wait for, for like weeks until the thing swaps. Well, no, you can do it all manually. You just have to do tricks okay so let's assume that you're an, a normal ass human no then you just then you play through and hopefully you don't die at all <laughs> okay but but like when the game was out much like in the in the fan server that's going right now wouldn't the world tendency like shift every few weeks or something uh, like that they would occasionally adjust it on the servers so it would just force the world tendency to be a specific tendency Right. For an area. As an event. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I mean. Right. So you could have a save game that maybe you screwed up, but then you can still go get some world tendency stuff. Right. What have I picked up? Oh, I picked up fire bombs. Wow. Not going to use those I'm gonna save for a them. while. There's a boss that fire works really well on, so it's a good idea to save them. How many elements are in this game, Fiona? Elements? Oh, um. well, do you mean like weapon upgrades? Or do you mean like fire, lightning... Uh, I think like it's fire a standard lightning. fire lightning magic. Okay, and and, that, and, that, and then is there like a status effect holy or a status effect poison? That uh, that's I mean not it has element, poison, but... it has toxic. Um... Ooh, it's throwing fire bombs at me. Yeah, see that's a good buddy. 
So it's got the standard assortment of stuff from Souls games. I mean, this is a pre-Souls Souls game. It is a pre-Souls Souls game. Yeah, what? Do you know much about the development history in terms of um, who from, actually did what? From Soft? Not really. Uh, from, from Software. One, once again, we're not trying to jump up half pipes getting to the top of the treehouse so that we can like get collect the word skate <laughs> is that what is that like the tony hawk yeah game? yeah yeah um or am i that's i'm not thinking never what's never soft they're they're like, never soft is like a dnd develop like video game oh. developer isn't it something like that i don't remember never soft oh no i'm thinking of always soft oh no that was a joke <laughs> I I am funny. <laughs> I don't get that joke. Is that a sex joke? Ew! No! What? No! Why do you all, you I'm all asking, do this to I'm me? I'm so asking right now. I'm an innocent ex-Catholic. I have a shield. I just always forget to use it. <laughs> Dodging out of the way and like doing crazy <laughs> like like you missed me. Well, shields are only for sick parries, and that's it, right? Yeah. Like you can't block things with them. All right, he's dead. Okay. Go. There's a lot of there's a lot of items in this game, like a lot, a lot of items. And because we're going quality, we're going to be getting. A <laughs> we lot need of them. a lot of them. Yeah. Uh, look at this. We remember this trick from previous games. Or, or from post. You mean the next games? <laughs> yeah. <sighs> We've reused a lot of tricks. Let's say I fell down too far. Oh. Well, I mean, I think it's fair because, like, while Metal Gear Two Solid Snake was a great game, mm -hmm. I think it's fine that they just made Metal Gear Solid from Metal Gear Two Solid Snake. A like, bastard sword. Fun fact: If you don't know this, Metal Gear Solid is essentially just a 3D remake of Metal Gear Two Solid Snake for, oh. for the MSX. For MSX, wow. Right. I only had I played the original NES game. Yeah. Yeah. Well, but they, that was a totally different game. Like, well, the I think the original Metal Gear was I think that was the same. But but if you played the the sequel, then that one was different for sure. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's great oh, though. Do you remember enjoying it? Uh, it's been a long time. Yeah. So I don't really remember it. Oh, are you gonna go for the boss buddy over here? Oh no. There's like a, I don't know, not not really a mini boss, but. Oh, let's try to not die. Try this one weird arrow tip. Souls hate it. Ah, oh, that, oh, oh yeah, yeah yeah yeah. Watch out! Watch out for that arrow. <laughs> oh, oh. <gasps> yeah, I died. Yeah. Oh, no. Woo! Oh shoot. Oh, I don't know why these two are like the blacksmiths. Fight. They're just brothers. Fighting. They fight. Like Notice this. they're covered in scales. Creepy. Uh, right. So are you just going to book it? I'm not going to fight everything on the way up, but um, I don't also don't have to pick up any of the items so I can kind of go faster. Yeah. Because a lot of the reason I'm fighting this, jar this stuff is just to like get all the items because you do want them all. Oh, sure. Yeah. Like they're too useful to not keep. I would even say they're three useful. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you know this, but uh, because of your ability to run through games really quickly, we secretly call you Sonic behind your back. Oh, geez. Really? That's rude. Yeah, it is pretty rude. The three of us, the other the other <laughs> uh, Let's Play channel associates. Oh. That was like a kind of a sweet X strike almost. Kind of. That was a good shield, good shield. All right, ah. you have some friends. That's fine. There. Cause I mean, dudes only follow you for so long. It's, it'll work out. I, well, okay. They're not proving my point particularly well. <laughs> Did you that's, see that cool shove? Yeah, that's interesting because they made that into a like a like a kick. In Dark Souls, yeah, but I, I like that it's just like a shove. Yeah, it's just a it's a guard. It's meant to be a guard block kind of thing, right? Like like a, if in PvP it actually does like quite a bit of stamina damage if you're holding your shield up, I believe, right? Crescent. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's meant to stagger you. It's like a guaranteed stagger. Uh, and I guarantee that you're gonna go to the next episode of Demon's Souls. So thanks for watching, everyone. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the subscribe button. And check out the details of our Patreon. It's right. in the end card in the video description. Bye, everybody. Bye.